Halloween is on uh -huh. Thursday, and the weather right now, it's going to be a nice start to the week, but we are tracking a pretty powerful storm set to bring in widespread precipitation back across Colorado. I'll show you that coming up. But this morning, it is dark and dry. Temperatures really mild if you're getting ready to step out the door. Low 50s downtown, 62 out at the airport. High 50s extend from Aurora to Castle Rock. It is freezing right now over Berthoud Pass, but compared to this time yesterday, not quite as chilly. Low 50s for Colorado Springs. The wind set to pick up later on today. No advisories for the Denver metro area north and east, but just from Lyman to Burlington down across southeastern Colorado, fire danger set to be elevated. A fire weather warning will take effect for Colorado Springs down through Trinidad until 6 o'clock tonight starting at 11 a.m. And then our high country set to see more snow accumulate over our higher mountain peaks, especially above 9,000 feet. Taking us through our metro area planner today, sunrise after 7 will be under a partly sunny sky today. 11 o'clock, upper 60s and daytime highs very warm for this time of the year. 79 expected, mid 70s in Boulder. Usually our high temperatures top out around 60 degrees. The record today is 82. We are expecting some 80s over the southeastern plains right around 3 p.m. And let me take you through the timing of everything. A little more cloud coverage expected for today. Some peaks of sunshine here and there over I-25 as we get into this afternoon. Scattered rain, then snow showers develop. But as we get into later on tonight through early Tuesday morning, you can see more widespread precipitation impacting the southwestern corner of the state. Heavy rain and snow at times, so travel in the mountains may be very tricky Tuesday through at least Wednesday morning. Strong winds, cooler temperatures tomorrow here in Denver in the low 60s. It's not a major snow event for us here across the metro area. Could see a few showers here and there, mostly the mountains seeing accumulating snow with this one. But we do have the potential for a rain-snow mix through at least October 30th, and then for Halloween we'll clear out. 10-day forecast temperature-wise, we will see some slightly cooler air and wetter weather stream into the state. Here's what it looks like on our Super 7-day forecast. Today, 79. The record is 82. Overnight lows fall to the 40s by morning. Winds pick up, sunshine low 60s, a few showers late in the day. It'll be early Wednesday morning where we'll see a rain-snow mix, potentially more accumulating snow in the mountains and into the foothills, and then we'll clear out. Thursday, upper 50s and partly cloudy skies with high 50s, low 60s, more seasonal weather through the weekend. Yeah.